elaborate. This is Pranora and I will see you again in other types. So today we are going to learn about how to interface the LCD with the microcontroller. So this is the design I have made. Uh, I am giving the port to, to the LC RS RW RE and port 3 of microcontroller to the LCD this data pin. And these three pins, you are going to require these three pins for to operate this LCD. And uh, also there are two pins, which is the backlight, which is not given in the simulation. So let's design the code to display something. So suppose, uh, you know, this is the code we require in a, every program. So over here, I have made some thing. This is has the define LCD as put 3. So whatever we are going to, whenever we will use LCD, that means we are sending data on the port 3. So this is data pin of the port 3. Let me comment down here for you. Data port. This is the delay function we require. And there are two functions we are going to need if we are going to use the LCD that is the, for the command and for the data. Let's make it LCD. So we will define this function. Now we have just declared this function and we will define this below down over here. When you are defining the function, you need the semicolons. So in this function, we will first of all, we are going to need the arguments. Suppose the arguments are character arguments. Character value. Same argument argument we are we are going to need in data also. We will pass the arguments in these functions. And that argument will be going to the LCD pin that is the port 3 and then we are going to need three pins that is RS, RW and enable. So let's define those pins in data also we are going to need this define these pins so, Define those pins with the SB register so, RS on the port 2. RS is on the 2.0. On 2.1, we will need the RW pin and enable pin on the 2.2. So what are RS, RW, enable? I have uh, explained in my previous video. Uh, if you want to know about this, then uh, click on the suggest button, uh, and also in the description I have given the link. Now, as we are using port two and port three output port, I am making it zero. There is no need to make this zero. If you want to do it, then do it. Otherwise, it is not required. Now let's define the LCD CMD and LCD data. So in CMD means we are sending the commands with help of this function. So if you are sending the commands, then your registers select register need to be zero. So it will tell the LCD that I am sending you the command. Microcontroller is sending you the then rw will be zero because we are writing we are not reading from the lcd that's why then we will enable the pin we will enable the lcd pin and after some delay we will disable the pin same program we will need in the lcd data just data in we will tell the register select set it one because we are writing uh, we are uh, sending the data 
and when we are sending command it will be zero so let me write down over here sending command writing data enable lcd sending data paste is same i am going to write it now here first of all you need to give the command in the lcd so i am giving the command over here the first command you are going to need so there are some command given over here uh, you can see so these commands are going to help us to give some style to give some uh, commands to the data where it will show you i will explain you how to use these commands so first of all you're going to need this command two lines and five cross seven matrix we are using that's why we are going to use the 0 cross 38 to so pass the value 0 cross 38 then next command we are going to use is display on cursor off so we are going to show the display but we are not going to show the cursor so and the third command which gives the position of your lcd so there are two rows if you are using this command it will force the data to be on the first row you are using this it will force the data to be on the second row and as it is zero that means the initial position the zeroth row zeroth matrix and you can uh, increment it from zero to the f and this also zero to the f. i'll show you over here now first of all i will use the zero so you will understand when i will change it Now I will send one character. You can send character in using this inverted comma. Let's give some delay of. I think we are ready to check our program is right or wrong. So just click on this and you will see there is error. Let's see what errors are those. LC data don't have the argument. First of all give the argument run it again and there is one warning because of my serial number has expired <coughs> that is the another thing we are not concerned with that so let's check all here Dumping the program, Let's see if we, can. we can see A on the first row and zeroth position. Let's move it to the fifth position. Let's see because of this, you can move it to the fifth position. You can see it is from here to here it went so let me comment down here for you we are using 5 cross 7 matrix this is to on the display but we are not going to see the cursor This is to the first row. You can also see at the second row, just make it C and C. It changes not. So it came down from the first row to the second row.
let's send some more characters i'm going to write my name over here let's see we can see it on the else or not just change it to the first row so i can see my name on the cd and it's in the first row and at the middle so it looks good and we are i will tell you again that we are using the same data pins to send the commands and send data pins to the send the data just this rs pin you can see it's blinking that means when it is going to read that means it is sending the data and when it becomes the blue it sends the command and rw is continuously blue that means zero so it is just writing not ready and we are enabling and disabling the pin in the function you have seen so i will explain you what's uh, happening over here so this is the header file you know and this is the data port we have p3 uh, we have defined this is the delay function these are the two functions we have declared over here and these are is rw enable we have gave the name to these pins here uh, we made those pin output pin and uh, lcd command we are sending the command 0 cross 38 so it is uh, it comes over here that goes to the port number 3 that means the lcd and then it tells it makes rs0 rw0 enable one so it is the command so this is the uh, every time you have to use these things this one and this function whenever you are using the lcd so same it uh, does for the 0 c and 8 5 and then it set the data so it takes the ascii character of the k you can see the ascii number of the a on google so it takes the ascii number and it sends Oh, no need. So you can send it to the port three, and from and then this arrangement uh, makes uh, tells the LCD that we are sending the data. So this is all from this video. I hope you learned something from this video, and uh, if you like this video, then please subscribe to my channel, and uh, if you have any kind of worry, then comment down below, and sharing with your friends. So they will learn to. Thank you so much.